What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, and reliable MT, and you want to get those spotlight challenges done, hit up my new sponsor DVDJ and use code YOURBOYBUGS for 10% off a checkout. And yeah man, check them out. What's good YouTube, it's your boy Bugs back with another NBA 2K20 MyT video, and guys, today, we have some market talk. I know you guys have been loving the market talk, I know you guys have been dropping subs like crazy. And yeah, thank you guys so much for 4,000 subs, bro. It's crazy how much the grind has paid off, man. 4,000 people love bugs. Hopefully, love bugs. I don't know if they're haters, but thank you guys so much. Um, make sure to drop 20,000 MT in the comments. I did give away 60,000 MT, so make sure to follow my Twitter because that's where I do my giveaways. Um, thank you guys so much, bro. I'm going to go over everything with you guys, everything you should know. Market is skyrocketing like crazy. Kind of want you guys to sell your cards ASAP before moments do drop. Have that MT ready to snipe moments and whatnot. And yeah, we're going to get into it. We're going to talk about a lot of cards, a lot of cards you should do, what you should do with your MT, what you shouldn't do with your MT, pretty much everything involved with the market. And maybe some snipe filters. I know you guys did see my top five snipe filters yesterday. Do my, my do my locker code video yesterday when all of my snipe video went off. Thank you guys so much, bro. We've been gaining subs like crazy. And this is just the beginning. I know we're going to get to 100K one day. And you guys, you guys are gold. You guys are the OGs, so... Thank you guys so much. All right, without further ado, let's get into it. So I want to talk about a lot of things. So first off, um, I think there should be a token market update either this week or next week. There has to be one. Um, not only that, man, these token market packs are so ass. But my opinion, I think something crazy could be coming in this token market. So stay tuned for that. Keep your tokens there. Keep your MT there. 2K has kind of been slacking over the last week with content, in my opinion. I think the Frostbite content was terrible. The packs were terrible. I think everything about it was terrible, my opinion. So, right now, hold your tokens, hold your MT. We're going to get some MT. Um, what you should do with your MT. So, right now, man, if you guys have a team, you have to sell your team now. Um, I actually, I literally said the market peaked, what was it, Thursday? or no, Saturday? Market has peaked today. It has went up to a new amount of crazy amounts of MT. And yeah, everything is up so much. And looking at it, bro, it's crazy. Zion was selling for 200k yesterday. I've never seen that. I don't know why he was 200k. Critty selling for 223 with 20 minutes left. Birds are selling for 230. Um, everything's crazy, crazy, crazy right now. And I just want to tell you, if you have a team, I, if you have any card that's a pink diamond, even diamonds, bro, you got to sell. I'm going to go over a lot of things. You guys have to sell your team. Yao Ming is at 152. All right, he has the shoes, whatever. Yao Ming was selling for 100K two days ago. So also, we're going to have Prime too. We can have a lot of things coming this week in NBA 2K20. So this week, we can have either Prime, we can have a new Spotlight, we can have a new Flash, we can have... A token market update. So honestly, my predictions, and we have all what's it called? Oh my god, we have all star coming next week. What's uh if? So yeah, all star weekend is next week as well. So a lot of stuff's going down. I just want you guys to have as much MT as you can. That's why I am selling sell a lot of your stuff because if you think about it, man. If you have a whole team worth of pink diamonds and they're this expensive, just get rid of them and trust the process. That's all I'm going to say. Don't have them locked in your collections. Never lock in anything, bro. You want to have max MT to make more MT, if you see what I'm saying. If you want to get some the Prime 2 sets done, all these sets done, you have to have MT. You do... Like, honestly, okay, I understand if you're playing competitive and whatnot, but you have to somehow sometimes work the market and stuff, you know what I'm saying? So... Right now, this is my team. I can't sell him. I can't sell him. Can't sell Giannis. Can't sell Doug West. I'm keeping Chris Dobbs and Bosch no matter what. Even though I should sell them, it's just because I I just they're locks on my team. Those are the only players I consider locks. I have a ton of diamonds that I will be selling. I have a ton of MT. I'm ready to roll. Moments are dropping tomorrow. If you didn't see my vid, go check it out. But yeah, there's a lot to talk about right now. Um, with the market being so high, you must sell all cards. Don't ask me what, what card should I sell? What should I do? Should I sell this card? Should I sell this card? No. Sell your cards. I don't care what it is. Amethyst, rubies, sapphires, silvers, diamonds, pink diamonds. If you have a galaxy opal that you cannot sell, <laughs> I'm joking. Just sell your cards. 
I'm gonna go over a lot of I'm gonna go over some snipe filters in this too. Some that have been working for me, some that should be working for you. And uh yeah, I'm also gonna talk about some frostbite players, maybe some players you should stack up on. Um yeah. Okay, so let's talk about this. So Kevin Martin might be a good a snag, bro. Um honestly, I pulled a ton. I probably dropped a Honestly, I probably dropped 500,000 on the packs. No, uh, I would say about 300k on packs, and I have gotten Kenyon Martin or Kevin Martin so many times, and it makes me wonder. He is usable and he's Evo, so honestly, you could try sniping him out. This actually might be a really good snipe method, and honestly, you could maybe even snack up on him if you get him for 4k or less. But his three pointer. His defense is decent. At a diamond, it's probably even better. Oh, uh, let's see. What's his diamond card going for? Is there really none up here? Oh, that's why. Um, Kevin Martin. Let's look at his diamond. So, he's actually probably really good. How's his perimeter? Oh, my goodness. This card is really good. So, honestly, this card kind of is a little hype beast. Some people might want to try to pick him up for the low. And, honestly, I do respect that. You guys should try picking up Kevin Martin's Amethyst for 4K or less. Sell them on Sunday. These packs are gone, I believe, maybe Thursday. What do we got? Uh, two days, 16 hours, which I do believe is Thursday or Wednesday. So make sure to sell your cards. Get ready for new content. Always, always sell them. If I say sell, you got to listen. Um, some snipe filters, man. Try out the Amethyst 2000 for low ballers, bro. It's actually so money. Every time I jump on it, I always get something. Make a quick 1,000 MT+. plus. You get like KD, LeBron. You get a lot of things from this filter. Try it out, man. And not only that, I've been noticing when the Amethyst filter, when there's a lot of cards stuck at 2,000 MT, like the other day, Brian Reese was rocking around 2,000. He's now at 3K. If I bought 100 of them for 2,000 and made 1,000 profit off each, um, what's it called? And I made 1,000 profit off each, bro. I literally made 100K. So it's crazy how quick the market goes up. He goes from 3K uh 2k 1900 to 3k so fast and it's kind of crazy this jerry sloan for low budget you can make a quick 600 mt real quick and it'll probably sell in seconds there's a lot of different ways to make mt but yeah i'm gonna go over some cards a lot of people have been talking about should i pick up tracy should i lock him in honestly this is what i think about this so we got tracy at 460 with eight minutes left this is my opinion so First off, okay, Tracy McGrady is one of the best cards in the game, no lie. I want him so bad. I've been trying to get him for so long, but this is what I'm saying. If you're going to pick up Tracy McGrady today at 500k, all I have to say is you're crazy just because of the fact 2k randomly releases locker codes, possibly on Valentine's Day or something, All-Star Weekend. They always release something at a certain time. Like Christmas, they release fire locker codes. Prime 1 is, is going to get old within the next month or two. With Galaxy Silver Royale and Tracy. You have to realize, Tracy is one of the best shooting guards in the game. He is going to get lowered and lowered as the days go on. 500k, if they drop a locker code or anything, ruining his price, go down to like 200. Honestly, at 500k, I don't think so. You can maybe get him for 300. I respect the 300k or, or less. Um, I do not respect you getting him for 500k. Yeah, right now he's sick. In about a month, he's not going to be really worth it, so... If you do want T Mac, I would wait. I want. I want him so bad. I have enough MT to get him right now. I'm trying to wait as long as I can. I need this card. I need him so bad. Also, if you do want to get Chris stops, wait till Friday. If you want to get any card, wait till a pack drops like the Frostbite. Moments somewhat crashed auction. Not really. You want to wait for something crazy like maybe Flash or something like that. That is when you really want to pick up cards. Okay. Really, um, since the market is super high, I really do not recommend you guys buy anything. If you do buy anything, literally just hand your MT over to anybody. You pretty much can give your if you say if you sell your team or wait on Friday, let's say content drops Friday and you sell your team Friday, you lose hundreds of thousands of MT. That's why today there's no content, there hasn't been content out in three days. Markets at its peak peak, Zion's are selling for 200, Christophs are selling for 250. I'm just going to stress this every time, bro. Sell your team. Thank me later. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. Make sure to drop that sub. Um, 4K subs, we're here. Let's hit 5. Let's hit 10. Let's hit 20. We're ready to roll. Hope you guys did enjoy. Let me know how it goes. Let me know if you have some questions and whatnot. That's really all I got. Stay tuned for tomorrow for some heat on the content. Gameplay's coming soon. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace.